Hello everyone, I'm Jersey May 93 and this is episode 2 of The Basics where I showcase how fundamental basketball can get you better in NBA 2K. Today we'll be focusing on rhythm shots, what they are, when to take them versus set shots, and how to trigger them. Then we'll be highlighting catch and shoot moves so you can counter tight defense as a shooter and get to your spots. And finally, I'll showcase a series of examples of catch and go combos you could throw into your arsenal. So please hit the like button and subscribe as this will help the channel grow and you can get more content like this. Let's get into it. This first example will highlight how important timing is for shooters this year. You have to hit a shooter that has beat his man off of a cut in stride and on time. So now let's look at what a rhythm shot is. As you can see with a rhythm shot, the shooter will hop or do a one two step to take a balanced shot with their momentum carrying them in rhythm. This is very important to understand because you don't want to trigger a standstill shot, which will stop your momentum and can lead to tougher shot contests. And here's a couple examples of what that looks like with a standstill shot versus a rhythm shot. Of course, there's times where it's better to take a standstill shot over a rhythm shot. A good way to gauge this is by looking at the amount of separation the shooter has from the trailing defender. So this next chapter of this video will be focusing on what to do when the defender is still attached to the shooter and how to counter it. Now we'll focus on catch and shoot moves. This is where builds with difficult shot and blinders can really shine. First, we have counter dribbles, which are quick reactionary shots that should be used against closeouts. This allows you to use the defender's momentum against him and quickly go into a shot. If you make the right read, it's easy to green regardless of the defensive badge that the opponent is using. Here we'll be showcasing the pump fake pull-ups. These work best off screen and fades, even though they're not as quick as the counter dribble shots. Because of the pump fake, you're not going to be stuck by wasting a dribble. So this gives you time to read the defense or use your triple threat juke badge. This also works well in very little space. You don't receive a big moving shot penalty like pull-ups or fades. So this is a perfect shot in late game situation and you have a defender that has given you too much space on the catch. And finally, for the catch and shoot moves, we have the swing and catch. This is not to be confused with the catch and drive animation, as you'll see in the next clip. The swing and catch works just like the dribble counter shot, but doesn't lock you into taking a shot. Another key aspect of this move is it will always carry you into a pull up or fade. First, the catch and drive, which will trigger a standstill jump shot. Also, the swing and catch works like an escape dribble, so you could use this to set up spins or step backs, and you'll see that in a few seconds. A bonus move you can use is the moving pump fake. Even though you will pick up your dribble, this move done correctly is unguardable versus tight defense. The moving pump fake works like the hard stop dribble from past two Ks. This allows you to stop on a dime and then go into a shot or even jump into the defender and draw a foul. Of course, you have to be moving and have momentum, but they trigger like regular pump fakes. And with blinders, you'll have an easy green as long as you don't time your jumper too late. All right, so this part of the video is really for anybody that's trying to make a dirk type build or trying to use shot creating bigs and you're not the quickest on the court or don't have a high dribble 
rating. This will show you some combos you could use with him. It doesn't have to be specifically his animations, but just a nice little reference sheet. So if you guys can please get this video to 100 likes as well as subscribe, that would really help the channel out and you guys can get more content like this. I'm Georgie 93 peace. This is Rick's Rock Production.